well, well, well. Here we sit on a beautiful Friday evening. Or morning, sorry. Good morning to you uh, and yours, folks. Today is Friday, June 17th, 2022, and this is the 374th installment of Florida Winter Sports Talk. Uh, we have NBA Finals to discuss. Something tells me the Celtics uh, <laughs> definitely took an early flight home to discuss you know, whatever they had to discuss. <laughs> as well, we got news, um, scores to go over as well. Um, again, I want to say thank you uh, from the bottom of my heart, honestly. Um, if you have been following the show's latest NFL segment, uh, 32 and 32 Draft Edition, um, I had lots of fun studying those players, watching film, watching highlight videos, um, and taking and comparing notes between the players. Being able to present it to you guys um, and talk sports is really a passion. Um, but I'm going to proceed with the tone. Stop sticking. I uh, hope I got it right. Anyway, 4 and 3 Sports Talk episode 374 starts now, and it starts with news. World Cup coming to the USA. Um, it appears that host cities, uh, the list of host cities uh, has been revealed. 11 venues in our home country, uh, 3 in Mexico, and 2 in Canada. Uh, 16 North American cities altogether um, in the 2026 World Cup. That's awesome. Uh, we will be the first tournament hosted by three different nations um, in the history of the uh, World Cup. And the field of competition has expanded to 48 teams. You always know, uh, as far as sports is concerned, inclusion is always good. Um, moving on, Adam, Adam Hadwin shoots a 66 to take uh, first round lead at the U.S. Open. Adam Hadwin is not going to win this U.S. Open. I think it's going to be my boy Colin Morikawa. It's a rough prediction. Uh, Phil Mickelson is in jeopardy of missing the cut at the uh, U.S. Open after uh, carding an 8 over. 78 is his score. Uh, he shot a 78. Um, one of the reasons why Mickelson says he prefers the new LIV International um, Golf Series is because of the multiple 54 hole events um, that they'll be hosting. Like, dude, you can't even make the U.S. Open cut. The United States host cities for the 2026 World Cup um, are as follows. New York and New Jersey obviously will be at MetLife Stadium. Uh, Los Angeles will be at Sophie Stadium. I forgot where is Sophie at? I think Sophie's the Rams? Yeah. Uh, Dallas um, obviously at AT&T Stadium. Um, San Francisco's in the Bay Area. They get um, a show at Levi Stadium. Miami, um, Hard Rock Stadium. Atlanta, Mercedes-Benz Stadium, where the Falcons play. Uh, Seattle, Lumen Field in Houston. NRG Stadium, where the Houston Texans call home. Um, I'm excited for the World Cup, honestly. I, I'm, a, I'm a, a quiet fan of uh, quiet fan of soccer. Anyway, cheaters um, in Dallas Cowboys head coach Mike McCarthy is fined again, second year in a row, this time 100 k for uh, violating off-season practice rules and, re and were removed of their 2023 OTAs because practice was too physical. Um, a year ago, he was fined 50000 for the first offense. Come on, you fucking idiot. Like, Cleveland Browns star pass rusher Jadavian Clowney, uh, back on a one-year $11 million deal, um, proved to me deal, um, says that newly signed $230 million quarterback into Sean Watson was the reason that he decided to come back and give it another go, not to mention how, uh, that defense I mean, on paper is stacked. Anyway, Stephen Golden State Warriors are your 2022 NBA Finals champs. Four rings in eight years for the for the team. Um, Curry ties LeBron James with four apiece. They both got four. Um, he was also named Finals MVP, and tonight he dropped 34. And yes, he hit a three. Um, that shot's back. Golden State worked hard, grinded all year, and this team was pushed to the limit, but they never folded, and they wasn't gonna let them bum ass Celtics beat him, right? <laughs> That's it for the news. Let's talk. Um, we'll continue with this uh, talk of the uh, NBA Finals. Golden State over Boston won 03 to 90. Golden State wins the series 4 to 2. Uh, Steph Curry with uh, 34 points, 7 rebounds, 7 assists, 4 for 4 at the line, 55% from the field, and 57% from Trey. He was named the 2022 NBA Finals MVP. Uh, and the Celtics were left packing. Um, about the Celtics, they have a great young team, and I'm think they will be back next year. Maybe not to the finals, but definitely to the postseason. Um, that's it for NBA. Let's talk Major League Baseball. Oakland over Boston, 4-3. Uh, snaps the Red Sox uh, winning streak, which is uh, obviously not good news to me and other Red Sox fans. 
Uh, San Diego versus Chicago Cubs, 6-4. Baltimore, 10. Toronto, 2. Cleveland, 4. Colorado, 2. Uh, Philly, 10. Washington, 1. New York Yankees, 2. Tampa Bay, 1. Uh, the Mets, 5. Milwaukee, 4. And the Texas, 3. Detroit. WNBA time. Uh, New York over Washington, the lone game, 77-56. NCAA baseball. Uh, uh, today, later on today, we have Oklahoma at number five, Texas A&M. That's at two o'clock, and then at seven, Notre Dame versus uh, the number nine, Texas a That's it for NCAA baseball. Western Mass sports girls across quarterfinals, Division One. Wellesley over Walpole, ten to four, and Westwood over Lincoln Sudbury, sixteen to two. Ooh. Today, um, the Division One and five state championships will be played. Um, and those are for Peabody and Taunton, Peabody and Taunton at 5.30. Both teams are undefeated in the, in the Massachusetts State Tournament at 4-0. Um, Division 5, West Boylston at Greenfield, and that is for 3 o'clock. Yeah, that was for 3 o'clock. Greenfield Green Wave are 19-6 on the year, and they come into the championship game on a 10-game win streak, um, giving up six runs in the last five outings, and have only given up five runs in a single game one time this year. It was on May 17th. Um, they're going up against a red-hot West Boston team, who are also coming on a streak of their own, which is a five-game, um, and they've outscored opponents 33-3 to in that span. And most of those, those four of those five games were... Uh, um, in the state tournament, so it's also something that's to be uh, noteworthy about. What's in store for tomorrow? Um, as we continue on, Western Mass Sports continues as a full day. A full day of state tournament uh, games are scheduled to start as early as 9 a.m. Um, lacrosse tennis softball for the girls' side. Um, uh, boys' side, we have lacrosse, I believe, baseball, volleyball, and tennis, something like that. Um, so yeah, sorry, I didn't mean to get a little distracted. Um, please make sure you check back with us tomorrow for more Western Mass stuff. We, um, we'll have scores, all that for you. Um, this marks the end of episode 374. I'm Rahim Eskali. 49 subscribers now on YouTube. If you could um, check us out over there and go help us out um, trying to bring that number up. And thank you for all your support of this show as it continues. Um, love you all. Wish you nothing but health, wealth, and success. And